here is how you change the video quality in CapCut. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on new project and I'm just gonna click play on this video and I'm gonna click add. This is gonna add it to our timeline and you can see it's simply a skier that's coming in, all right? So what we wanna do is come up to the top right hand side and we have 1080p up here, okay? Now, if we click that, it's gonna open the drop down. Now, this is where we can adjust the quality. So maybe we want it 720p. So we wanna reduce the quality, right? So standard definition, this resolution used for most TikTok videos. Let's put it up, for example, high definition, the ultimate viewing experience. 2K to 4K restores your video to ultra HD definition, but uses more memory. Now do bear in mind, this isn't gonna enhance your video from low quality to high quality. If it is recorded in 4K, it means you can keep it at 4K. If it's recorded at 1080p, it will be in 1080p. I would advise using the same setting that it was recorded at. So if it's HD, 1080p, or it's for TikTok or Instagram, then 1080p is probably fine. Now frame rate, you don't really need to worry about too much. This is gonna adjust basically how many frames per second there are. If we put this up, it's gonna basically decrease the speed of the clip and slow it down, but it's not the best way to do it. Again, if your video was recorded at 60 frames, this is gonna allow you to basically change a frame rate, adjust the speed that way. But normally, if you haven't got a super duper camera, we'll just stick to the default of 30. Okay, but if you do need to save file size, you can move this down and you can see the estimated file size is also changing as we change this top slider. So there you go, that is how you change the file size, the definition, and the frame rate in CapCut.